This video will show how to use cloud computing to convert speech to text programmatically. Open an account on the IBM Cloud. After login to the site, click Resource List button. Under Services and Software section, select Speech to Text. I choose London as location. Note down the API key and the URL. They will be required in the code. Next, open PowerShell Windows. Use vcpkg, a Microsoft Packager, to easily integrate the library to our project. Type command vcpkg install libgirl x64 windows to complete the install. Use command vcpkg list to check. Use command vcpkg integrate install to our project. Include the curl.h in the header. The input audio file, test.og, is opened in binary mode. Use ifstream object member function seek, followed by parameter 0 to position the file pointer in the beginning. Use the ifstream member function, read, to copy the content to the vector. We will need the char pointer to the audio data later. By the way curl stands for client URL it is used for transferring data using various network protocols. Obtain a char pointer by casting the vector's data like so. Declare a header variable of type struct curl s list and initialize it to null. Next let's get a handle to the curl by calling curl easy init function. If handle is valid, we will continue further. Pass our URL by calling curl easy set opt function. In the curl header, declare the format of our audio as og by calling the function curl s list append like so. Next curl opt http auth to tell the cloud server to allow any type of authorization mode. Use curl opt user pwd to pass our API key to the server. Using curl opt post field size command, specify the size of the audio data. Using curl opt post fields command, specify the pointer to our audio data. Next, call curl easy perform to send out curl command to the server. If all things are good, the server should return a curl eok response. Call curl easy cleanup to clear the occupied memory. I have changed the API key values in the codes for security reasons. Now run the code. The output text in JSON format are shown as transcripts. That's all folks. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe my channel.